No crater, no meteorite, just 80 million trees snapped flat in one heartbeat. June 30th, 1908. A fireball screams across Siberia hotter than the sun. Windows shatter 600 miles away. The blast 1,000 Hiroshimas flattens a forest half the size of Rhode Island in a perfect circle. Scientists hike in 19 years later and find nothing. No hoe, no rock, no metal. Only blackened trunks standing like burnt matchsticks. Bark turned to glass. Wild theories storm the tiger. Mini black holes, the nukes. Even antimatter. Satellites, radar, lasers, still zero debris. One clue, tiny glass beads in the soil say whatever it was exploded five stories above the ground and simply vaporized. But the trees keep whispering. Their rings carry mutated DNA, radiation signatures that shouldn't exist. A century later, the regrowth is still weird, branches twisted, needles blue-green. Whatever visited us didn't just knock down a forest, it rewrote its code. Tunguska is the universe's ultimate drive-by, a bullet that left no slug, only a fingerprint in our genes. We may never hold the weapon, yet every summer those mutant pines remind us. Something gigantic can brush earth and vanish without leaving a calling card.